A march through the streets of Johannesburg, South Africa, demanding a permanent ceasefire in Gaza. Hundreds, including members of political parties and other supporters, on Wednesday spoke with one voice as they marked the International Day of Solidarity with the Palestinian people. It calls upon each and every one of us to protest against any injustices that happens around the world. Because that thing that is happening in Palestine can happen to anyone around the world. So it calls upon each and every one of us to, to stand against injustice. So we are doing our intense human duty as people did with South Africa when we as black people were oppressed. People showed solidarity with us and this is the human imperative and duty to show solidarity and to support the cry of the oppressed people in the world. Last week, a majority of South African lawmakers voted in favor of a motion calling for the closure of Israel's embassy and the suspension of diplomatic relations. Like Netanyahu, who's killing children, who's bombing hospitals, who's bombing refugee camps. Comrades, we are here today, moved by the camaraderie and the spirit of unity among us. We as the ANC, we have said to our government, we have joined political parties in parliament calling for the closure of the Israeli embassy. The International Day of Solidarity with the Palestinian people has been celebrated since 1978 following the adoption of a resolution by the United Nations General Assembly.